Oh, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, wherever you are. This recipe, I'm gonna make it uh, steak and root vegetable pie. So I'm gonna teach you step by step how to make this delicious steak and root vegetable pie. Let's let's do it, people. This is the ingredients for my pie filling. So I got some beef, good quality beef. Got some diced potatoes, got uh, garlic, onion shallots, uh, beef stock, got some parsley, carrots, sweet potato, also we got olive oil, black pepper, salt and smoked paprika, okay? So let's do the recipe, okay? Let's start with the olive oil, let's add the garlic. Onion. Okay, let's fry it until it goes nice and golden color. Let's add the beef. Give a good mix. Look at that. That will give a lot of flavor at, at the parsley. Looking good, huh? Looking good. Let's add some water. Yeah, just a bit of water just to cover all the cover all, all the beefy. So I put water just to cover the beefy. And let's wait it to boil it. Huh? And let's add a bit of uh, smoked paprika. Okay. That's going to give a nice beautiful color as well. And as soon as it boils, let's add the sweet potato, the carrot and the other potato. Oh, it's starting to boil now. Here we go. Let's add the potato. Okay. Sweet potato and the carrot. everything there in a pan and let's give a mix and let's cook it for half an hour in a low heat eh? low heat not too high otherwise you're gonna lose all the juices you don't want to lose the juice so it needs to cook it slow so the potato and the, the carrot the, the sweet potato is gonna thicken up it's gonna give a nice flavor forget to put a bit of black pepper as well because black pepper is very very important yes a little bit of black pepper and also a little bit of salt not too much because I got the stock there and later on after half an hour 35 minutes we need to try see if the flavor see if the flavor is gonna be good eh? okay so if you think you need more flavor, after 35 minutes, you add some more salt, yeah? But now, let it cook slow for 35 minutes. Okay, that's the, my beef uh, pie, beef and root vegetable pie, uh, pie mix, look at that. The beef, all cooked beautifully, ready for me to make a plan, eh? To make this delicious beef and root vegetable pie. 
Now I'm gonna teach you how to do the pie crust recipe. Yeah, here we go. We got the ingredients here. So we got 315 grams of plain flour. We have one teaspoon of salt, two teaspoons of sugar, 215 grams unsalted butter, cut into cubes, must be cold, and we got some ice water, 120 milliliters. That's all the ingredients you needed. Okay, let's do it then, okay? So, first thing what you need to do is, okay, you got your bowl of the, of the flour, so I put your salt, so make sure you got all the ingredients inside, all the salt, got all the sugar, and I got the cube butter, cold, so I need to put everything in here, it's very very cold, I'm gonna do everything by hand, okay, I'm gonna do by hand, if you're cooking in a restaurant to use your gloves, I'm doing at home, it's for myself, uh, and my family, so okay, I don't need gloves, so I do by hand everything, okay, alright, so you're gonna mix it, into, into you turn this mixture into a crumble, crumble mix, it must be a crumble mix, and after that you can put your ice water, but before, before that you need to do it, this, until it turns into a crumble mix, eh? okay, with your hand, just like that, just like this, keep, keep mixing, never give up and soon as it turns to a crumble mix that means it's ready to put the water but until now just keep mixing you can take a bit of time but if you want to do a nice beautiful pie crust you need to take your time do it properly and that's the only way it's gonna work eh? okay so it's gonna get there, you just need to carry on doing it. So that's why it needs to be like that, into that crumbly mix, okay, like that. Now it's time to add the water, okay? Ice water, yeah, nice and cold. So you add it in there and let's mix it, eh? okay? Let's mix it. And that will be my pie crust pastry. Mix it properly. Enough of this needs to go in the fridge. Eh? This, this needs to go in the fridge to stay cold for at least four hours. And yeah. Look at this, eh? Look at this. Eh? Done by hand. Look at this, eh? See? Easy. And done it. Here we go. Pie. Crossed. Mix. Done by Ricardo Medellins, eh? Like you see, it's done. Now we're gonna wrap them into clean film. Okay, let's wrap them into clean film and let's leave in the fridge for four hours. And after, let's do the, the, that beautiful pie, savory pie, you know, or sweet pie, you know. You can use that for savory and sweet because it has a touch of sugar, a touch of uh, salt, so you can use for both sweet and savory. Beautifully done, eh? Four hours in the fridge, okay? Well, look at that. To make the pies, I got the Harry Bikers machine here. Look at that. Let's open. Wow, look at that. Here we go. There's the pastry. I just took out of the fridge. Look at that. It's nice and cold. And let's make some pies. Okay, that's my pie mix. Look at that with the beef and the root vegetables, which I done it before. Now it's cold now as well. So I cool it down um, for four hours. Look at that, it's turned up like that. And let's do this. Hey, beautiful people, it's ready. 
let's open this and let's start making fudge because I'm looking forward to try this machine here like that looking forward here we go wow look it's nice and cold so let's make it a pie just take a bit of that okay and then I'm just gonna put my hand to look at how beautiful pastry beautiful Look at that, even with my hands, it works beautifully, eh? even with my hands, eh? look at that, my, I can't even do it with my hands, really, yeah, look at that, with my hands, I can shape this up with my hands, nice and round, and don't need to, to use the, this one, eh? if you want to use that, you use it, but look at that, with my hands, with my hands, I'm doing this beautiful, eh? look at that, Eh? <laughs> I can do it with my hands. Beautiful. Now, but I will do it properly. I will do it properly because it needs to be done properly. So let's see it. Let's roll it a bit so it won't be thick in one side and thin in another side. So I try to fix it. It'll be much, much easier to work on. Huh? Okay, looking good, looking good, okay, all the same size, and look at that, beautiful, beautiful, very, very good. I've got the machine, let's squeeze it inside, need to be properly. That there we go. It's inside. Looking good. Eh? Now we got this one here to make the the, the top eh? to cut the top. Eh? Okay, let's make the top. on top eh? that all fits on top eh? but first I need to make the meat okay, I need to do another one let's do another one another round one and I've got two eh? and I'm gonna fill up with the meat eh? okay flower there flower on top of the bit Beautiful, I like that machine, I bought that machine yesterday in a, in a town called Crowley and it's good, I like the Harry Bikers, I'm quite a fan of the Harry Bikers they're very, very good British chefs and I'm really, really happy and I hope it's gonna turn up good, eh? I hope it's gonna turn up good eh? it's a nice machine, eh? not very expensive the machine it really it costed about 40 pounds and it's good. Okay, now let's fill it with my pie mix. Okay, so make sure you got enough beef, enough uh, vegetables as well. It needs to be delicious, eh? Beef. Yes, gonna be very, very delicious. Pie. Eh? Oh 
areas. It's going to be yummy. I can't wait to see the result of that. This beautiful pie. And a bit more beef in here. And some sauce. There we go. There. And that's it. Perfect. Okay, now the final thing is to do the your uh, the name, the topping. Make sure if you press it. Yeah, and the other side as well. Eh? We have another top here. You have to make sure if you push it. So make sure everything comes right to the end, press it. Yeah, looking good. Yeah, I know it doesn't work. There we go, look at that. Make sure nothing comes out. Yeah, okay, and let's close it. Okay, here we go, you know, you just put on and it's cooking, it's cooking, <laughs> That it's cooking, you can see the smoke is coming out and uh, you can see the button, it's red, when it goes green that means it's ready, so let's wait and see this beautiful beef pie, a beef and root vegetable pie. Look at the pie, wow, amazing, look at that, amazing, turn up a treat, eh? look at that beef and the vegetable, root vegetable pie, delicious, so beautiful, eh? so happy with the result of that, eh? so, so happy, eh? Thank you, Harry Bikers, eh? for the beautiful machine. <laughs> beautiful beef pie maker. Ah, yes! So happy. Look at that beauty. Look at this beauty. I'm so happy. I just made this beautiful pie, eh? <laughs> so proud of that, eh? thanks very much, eh? beautiful beef and root vegetable pie, eh? beautifully done, wow! Pessoal, eh? esta é uma pai perfeita, e agora vamos comer, let's go and eat, eh? this is the perfect pie, now we gonna eat, eh? Okay, people, let's cut. Wow, look at that. Look how beautiful it looks eh? inside, a lot of filling. Eh? Looks so good. Look at that, the pastry looks so beautiful, flaky, and the vegetables and the, everything inside looks so good and yummy. Eh? So delicious, eh? Look at that, eh? I can call this one of the best pies ever. Pastry, you know, the, the, the pie, the pastry, it's just perfect, and the filling is just perfect. So happy, so happy. Look at that. Oh, the beef is so tender. And the pastry. Ah, full of flavor. Oh, delicious. Very, very, very nice. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Do it at home. It's one of the best pies you're gonna have it. Believe that, eh? Yummy, delicious.